I thought I would take a video of the uh, Whitworth FK-10 uh, aircraft that just arrived yesterday from Hobby King. And uh, anyway, it came very well packed, kind of a box within a box, lots of that bubble stuff, uh, you know, the bags full of air or whatever else. And uh, oh, there's the wheels, front wheel assembly, and there's some other bits and pieces in there. It's fairly large, unbelievable. What else we got? Oh yes, we got the glue, and lots and lots of hardware. Wow, lots of hardware. A couple of connectors. There's the prop that I will break. First time out, apparently. These are, are fairly... Uh, how do you say it? Non-robust. There's a carbon fiber rod in there, which I'm also told is uh, too short. It's a three millimeter. I know where to get one. And there's some strut rods in there, I assume, for things like the ailerons or whatever. The wings. Yes, it has ailerons. It's the lower section, I assume. And it's Quite a good wingspan, as you can see. That's, uh, that's the, I guess, the top wing. That's the drab green on one side, and yellow with the bullseyes on the bottom. It's kind of ironic putting bullseyes on an aircraft. And more wings and bits, and I guess, yep, tail. There's the, the, uh, the flaps. And the fuselage. Oh, there's the rudder, right there. That one. Fuse life comes uh, complete with the motor already installed. Oh, it's even got a machine gun. Look at that. Cockpits aren't terribly detailed, but then what do you want for? Uh, I think this was forty-nine dollars on sale. Yeah, that's uh, all the rods are installed. Oh, another bag of hardware down there. So looks like a bit of fun. And oh, I got the. Uh, lithium battery as well, 3300 milliamp hour lithium and the bag, there we go look at that critter there it is that was on sale as well I think that was nineteen dollars so not bad for a 3300 milliamp hour lithium battery two cells with so 7.4 volts which is what the aircraft runs on uh, I just need to provide a receiver and transmitter which I already have it comes with four servos and whatever wiring and let me see this is the other bits oh yes a pair of extra props for the one that I'll break these are pretty cheap five bucks for the pair I think and I also ordered a tailwheel it's this little guy here because apparently these, uh, the, this Whitworth model comes with a tail pin, a little bent pin for the, for the, uh, the back, but it's not steerable so um, very well. I mean, it's, uh, you can hook it to the rudder, but the problem is, is that it's just a piece of wire, so it really doesn't follow the ground very much, especially if it's soft. The wheel will go onto that. You just turn the pin in, into the wheel, and uh, then it becomes steerable. So hopefully that will work out. Anyway, I'll take some other pictures here. And anyway, like I said, it comes very well packed. So now all I got to do is put it together and, of course, wait for spring. Anyway, that's the uh, Hobby King FK10 Whitworth quadruplane. I will take pictures as it goes. Stay tuned.